quick update on 7th of September on some of the developments. Um, spent a lot of time trying to get this to work. This is the uh, basis that we've got a uh, ability to get updates so and update. So in between your screen refreshes, there's a 30 second update from the feed. The feed actually updates every 15 seconds in the background, the actual data. Um, so we're going 30 seconds. I've done some testing, a couple of frames per second drop when you run the app, but I think that was there anyway, because you have to loop through two tables. One of the problems also is the fact that you get to know about everything that's going, um, being uh, taken on and offline, not just the things that are within range. The reason for that is that, that we don't get the lap long in the raw feed. One of the difficulties is making that actually work uh, is you have to go off and find the lat long from somewhere else. So this is just basically running through two lists and checking what's on and off. And you can see that uh, if something goes off London S control, or London South control has gone offline. There's the message in and you notice that we also make it go red. So in between your updates, you'll see that that, that is there. You'll also see that there are other things tower, uh, things coming online and they've also got a, a, a clickable uh, frame which can update and you can actually then call it on the radio there. So that's quite useful. Um, see some visual improvements. We've removed the final row. That's going to have a, an indicator of, for the radio being tuned in as an icon. Being discussed to colour code it, but it would be too difficult. Might colour code the uh, icon over here and have the actual radio assignment over here. Um, colour coded and consolidated the distance and range. You'll notice they're now put together. Just going through a quick update and what's important is that the instead of, we've got rid of the green crosses and if the controller is in range it will show up in green and the same for the stations here so you notice that it said that uh, Gatwick ground is online and now when we did the refresh there it is a uh, couple of things down here the buttons for delete uh, you I think we've seen this, some of this before the ability to turn system messages on and off that is also configurable in config.ini so you can have that as the default when you switch it on you can also turn off um, some oh it's interesting uh, another controller has gone offline there you can also turn off the uh, uh, updates uh, to check the controllers and you'll notice it says controllers you've got a confirmation back so now you can have completely silent and just having the core radio messages if that's what you want um, and you just switch it back on and off. And that's there. Uh, we've consolidated the config menu, move the filter menu, and I think that's probably about it for the moment. Going to release this as just the exe, and it's going to be an experimental one. So use at your caution, basically, because I haven't had a long time to test it. I like to normally test for about a week, but we'll make this one. And also, there are some fixes in there which you'll see from the change log. Uh, so I'm going to put this out in the next, hopefully, the next 24 hours. Um, just want to make sure it compiles up and runs okay in the sim. Um, and I'll say anyone who does um, the, uh, um, has got the uh, toolkit in, they can have a look at the frame rates for me and see if, make sure it's not hurting the frames too much. I am actually going to probably offload some of this filtering to the server at some point and uh, create a payload of changes and then just go and get those changes every couple of minutes. Or, or every minute or so and have the server doing the work pulling in the feeds um, which it's sort of doing at the moment but uh, we sort of spread the load okay that's it for now uh, I'll try and get this release out in the very near future but I just want to make a few things check a few things tonight and uh, make sure it's all working <laughs>